Um, we're at the Ottawa General uh, Campus and um, we're unveiling a, a very special art piece. It's called uh, the Sivunik Satinu Kayak and it's a glass kayak. I first met uh, Jennifer uh, Kelly at uh, her studio uh, while taking an introductory course and it, it just so happened she had this project in mind with a kayak and um, the organization I'm a, I'm a part of, uh, Tunga Suvinga Inuit, uh, happened to have a, an old uh, kayak frame. Uh, she had one of her own, but she wanted to use one that was authentic. Uh, so it just so happened Tunga Suvinga Inuit had one, so this is where the idea sort of was drummed up uh, to, to create a glass, uh, a kayak with glass panels. It's incredible because, um, because there are a lot of urban Inuit that frequent the hospitals. So, I mean, in the interview yesterday uh, with uh, one of the representatives from the Ottawa General, she said that uh, 1,500 Inuit frequent this hospital a year. So, to help bring them back home with a little piece of uh, Inuit art, uh, it's we thought it would be something positive for them when they're uh, at a place where typically there, it's not a, a positive thing. Like no, no one typically wants to come to a hospital. You're usually here to address an issue. So to to bring them a little bit of joy in a place where you know it's it's not always fun it's it's it was really important to do that well this is the first time i've got to see the kayak as a whole and it's just absolutely amazing to see the the whole finished product come together loosely based on the idea of reconciliation and traveling uh, representing our past which is a dark past and then moving forwards to a brighter future uh, and we use it from act physically from the back to the front as a way to symbolize us moving forward and uh, having a brighter future as, as a people. So it's, it's absolutely amazing. <laughs>